everybody there was 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 actually race fans. You know, I, I wasn't sure, but it was pretty cool to see that kind of a group. Um, and and I see that that changed a little bit. It it it, it was it used to be huge when you came into the airports, and and then it tapered off. Um, and I see that kind of coming back a little bit again. David. David Caravella, NASCAR.com. Uh, as someone who uh, took part in one of the Goodyear tire tests for, uh, for uh, in leading up to Indianapolis, can you kind of comment on the scope of kind of what Goodyear's undertaking here? I mean, seven tests, 40-something drivers, 13,000 miles. I mean, and this is something kind of, is this something unlike they've ever done before to well, get one race right? It's unprecedented. It's, it's unbelievable how much time, money, and effort has been spent you know, by them. And I don't think it was 100% there their fault you know i mean i think there were other contributions but they took the fall and they they contributed the most to fix it and um they i'm just confident and and glad that they did fix it you know they they put a lot of effort into a lot of different tests a lot of miles um and and not all those tests were necessarily successful ones but they learned from every one of them to be able to build the tire that that they have now that is seems to be fantastic Dustin. Dustin Long, Landmark Newspapers. Uh, Jeff, so far nobody's won more than three races this season, so nobody's got more than 30 bonus points. As somebody who talks about bonus points a lot, are you surprised that it's such a few, such a small number at this point, or I guess are you encouraged to, in your position that you tend to go, you're only two races behind? Yeah, no, I'm more encouraged, a little surprised, but more encouraged. But, I, you know, I, I still feel like, how many did you say, 10 to go? 10 to go. Yeah. Um, I still think somebody can rack them up in a hurry. So, you know, I'm encouraged because, yes, we're only 20 behind, and I feel like, you know, we can win races before the chase starts. I'm more anxious to win races in the chase. But, um, you know, 20 points to me is, is not a big deal. You start getting 50, 60 points behind somebody, and that's, that's, that's tough to overcome especially if it's somebody like the 48 or the 14 uh you know you just it's just tough to do so um you know we're, we're doing everything we can right now to, to take a little bit more risk in our strategy and our setups to to get ourselves some more bonus points and um and also get ourselves into a solid position to to, to win this time. i mean i still feel like that this is a great year for us uh, with a great opportunity to win this chase and win the first, you know, Sprint Cup uh, for us. I mean, I, to me, this this format's totally different, very challenging. We've never won it, and, and we want to really bad, and I think mean, this is a great opportunity for us to do that. Great, the gentleman right here. Gordon Kirby, Motorsport Magazine. Uh, Jeff, as you know, defeating uh, Chevrolet cutbacks in the Nationwide Series and are expected to take effect in, in the Cup Series as well. How do you see that uh, affecting Hendrick Motorsport? What are the challenges? Uh, for the team and for NASCAR as a well. whole. Yeah, I spoke to you know everybody at Hendrick this this week about it, and um, you know we we expected something you know to be done and and cutbacks to be made and and that you know the sooner we know about what's going to happen, then the the better we can react. And so you know they're having to react to to what's going on with with their company, and that's how we. Do it now. We we know what's happening, and we're going to react. And um, you know, we uh, we're still getting their, their support, but it's 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 changed. And um, you know, we're, uh, we're we're working through all that right now. How is it going to affect us? You know, when we can announce that or or, or talk more about it than than, than we will. Claire Beanley. At Clearview Lake Series NASCAR Radio, people were asking a lot about that because they feel like you're owner of, of the team too, and they're like, "How come Jeff hadn't known?" You know, and then you said you trusted Rick, which of course, you know, he does all that. Do you think it will be to the level of, and are you getting that involved that you'll have you'll play into what is done, and will it involve layoffs? Is it no one's going to tell us the amount of money, but is it so much that it will require you to lay people off? Um, I mean, you know, we had layoffs over the off season. You know, I mean, it, 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 we're we're not treating it any different than any other business that, that that's out there. You know, you you know what your income is, and and you have your 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 spreadsheets and what it costs you, and and so, you know, if uh, first first thing you do is you try to um, supplement that that lost income somewhere else. You know, you find out.